up everyone I'm your host Brian Watkins and welcome to the Brian Watkins channel I am sharing with my viewers what I miss most about Robin Williams what I miss most about Robin Williams was um, his unique comedy and timing I remember I think it was 1978 or 1979 when Mork and Mindy took the television by storm. It was a, it actually took place off of Happy Days. And um, he blew up. I remember when, um, what did he do after that? Well, he blew up so fast. He started doing the HBO comedy special, I believe, with Billy Crystal, Whoopi Goldberg. And if I'm not mistaken... Robin Williams, I think so. Uh, he did uh, Popeye, uh, Miss Doubtfire. He always did stand-up comedy. He always was in a lot of motion pictures. Good Morning Vietnam. I actually grew up with him, so um, I just miss his presence um, a lot because I learned a lot from him as far as how to, well, how to be funny, how not to be funny, how to, the timing. Um, and he was very animated. And I remember, like I said, Mork and Mindy. Uh, nano Nano. And Miss Doubtfire <laughs> when his breast caught on fire. <laughs> and he was taking those spoons and beating it out, trying to beat the fire out. But I've I've always liked Robin Williams. Um actually I was stunned that they they said that he killed himself. They said he suffered from depression a lot. And I was shocked because I didn't understand he was a superstar. He was legendary. And I don't understand how that happened. But it did. So uh, I miss him a lot because I think, let's see, him, Billy Crystal, Whoopi Goldberg, Dan Aykroyd, Chevy Chase, a lot of uh, very talented Comedians got their start around the same time with him off of Saturday Night Live, though he was not an original member from that. At least I don't think he was. I just remember Mork and Mindy, and he, he took off. He was still popular all the way up until he died. So I remember coming into a knowledge of him, I think in 1978 or 1979. It was a spinoff from Happy Days. I've always liked Happy Days. I've always liked watching... Happy Days, um, Laverne and Shirley, that whole era. That's where he came from. And I didn't know that he was from Michigan, and I'm from Michigan. So that was very nice to know to show that anybody can make it, and talent is everywhere. So, ladies and gentlemen, that is what I miss most about Robin Williams, his unique, animated, bold, comical talent. It was just limitless. So stay tuned and I will cover more. And if you have ones that you want me to cover, contact me and I'll do that. And subscribe to my channel and check out my other channel footage as well. Of who I miss most of Whitney Houston, uh, Richard Pryor, uh, Bruce Lee, just to name a few. Like or dislike my channel and place your comments. And don't you go anywhere and stay tuned for the Bryant Watkins channel. And I do videos daily. Stay tuned. Thank you.